Hello everybody, welcome back to our 3 info channel. Today I will show you how to fix touch screen not responding on POCO M7 Pro. So first, if your touch screen is not responding, then what you guys can try and do is to restart the device. So, force restart it by holding the power button and the volume up button at the same time for about 10 to 15 seconds. So, keep on holding until you see the screen go black and after you feel the vibration, you can let go of it. And now, all we have to do is wait for our phone to turn back on. So, I'll see you guys then. So now if this didn't help you then what you can try is remove any case or a screen protector because sometimes the bulky case or a big screen protector can interfere with the touch screen sensitivity. So try removing them and see if the screen responds any better. If not then go over to the settings and now click on the about phone section right up top here. And now click on Xiaomi Hyper OS. Make sure to update your software as soon as the new version comes out because a software bug can cause those touch screen issues, so updating to the latest version might fix the problem. So if an update is available, simply download and install it. Now if this didn't help you then what you can try is cleaning the screen. So any dirt, moisture, oils on the screen or debris can affect touch sensitivity. So use a microfiber cloth to gently clean the screen and make sure that there is no residue blocking the touch screen. So as you guys can see let me give it two swipes and now put it back. Here if this didn't help you then you can try and it's optional to check for touch screen calibration. It's not available in the phone, but you can download the app to calibrate your touch screen from the Play Store. I do not recommend this one, so it's only optional for you guys. So moving on, we have the factory reset. So if the issue is still here, then you might need to perform one. This will erase all your data, so make sure to back it all up first. Let me show you. Go over to the settings. Now click about phone here, scroll a bit down until you guys see backup and restore. Now here you have three types of backup, the local one, the cloud one and the Google backup one. I use the local and the Google backup and I've never used the Xiaomi one so I don't have any opinions about it. So now go over to factory reset and here click click on erase all data, control your pattern and now click factory reset here. So if none of that helped then what you guys can try is check for hardware issues like damaged touch screen or maybe a malfunctioning digitizer, the component that detects touch of course. So in that case it's best to contact Poco Sport or visit the authorized service center for more professional diagnostics and repairs. And that would be it. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and see you next time. Bye.